So what's going on everybody? My name is Blitzwinger, and ladies and gents, welcome back to a brand new Fortnite video here on the Blitzwinger YouTube channel. Of course, don't forget, like always, hit that like button if you guys enjoyed the video, and also, if you are getting V-Bucks in the Fortnite item shop, please consider using a supporter creator code, the Blitzwingers. Now, with that in mind, what are we up to today? Well, today we're going to get to finally completing some of these challenges. I apologize that I haven't done some of these guide videos over the last little while, but I promise that starting with week seven, we're going to get all the challenges completed as they need to be. Now, with that in mind, what are we focusing on today? Well, we're actually going to focus on the first challenge of week number six, and that is to visit a wooden rabbit, a stone pig, or a brick pig, because it's really made out of brick, and then, of course, last but certainly not least, a metal llama. So, all three of those will be completed here today. My suggestion to you guys is to make this process as simple on yourself as possible, and make sure that you're completing the challenges easily without being worried about getting destroyed all the time. Switch to Team Rumble because that means, or hopefully Team Rumble is available uh, while you're trying to complete the challenge. But the reason why you would want to switch to Team Rumble is because when you're in Team Rumble, there's only 40 players on the map. So even if some people do go to the spot where you want to go, you'll, you'll still be fine. And then furthermore, of course, the respawning is really the big benefit. Because even if you do run into the people landing where you want to land, you don't have to worry about it because... Even if you get destroyed, you got killed, it's fine. You can respawn and redrop to that spot before the storm heads into the location that you're after. Now, for the most part, most of the items are actually located in the top quadrant of the map here. So the first location we're going to go to is actually all the way up here. And this is B1. Then we're going to also visit A4 right here on the edge. Um of the map right there on that little mountain right there. And then after that, we're headed all the way down to Lucky Landing, all the way over to here. But I guess first things first, Junk Junction it is. Let's head over there. That is going to be our first visit. And of course, I would suggest to complete... I don't know if we'll be able to complete this on one run. We're gonna try. I think it's doable. I mean, we do have to worry about the storm, of course, but I really do believe that if we are quick about it, we should be able to land Junk Junction, rotate, run down here, get this done, and then after that, make all the way down here to Lucky Landing. Now, of course, in addition to that, what we could do is always just jump down, respawn, and um, use that to get around much quicker. So, here's our first location all the way over here. You might notice a big, ginormous metal llama just standing there waiting for us to make our landing so it looks like other players have the same exact idea in mind very smart if I'm a sister myself so there we are now that we've landed there we're gonna pivot down here I do wish that there was um, like you heard that guy just disconnected so you could do that too of course I do wish that there was a baller here because if there was a baller, that would make things very, very nice and easy on us uh, as far as this challenge is concerned. Because we would just be able to go on ahead and ball her out of there. So that would be terrific, of course. Unfortunately, uh, there is not such a thing here. So instead, we're going to make way across. And I guess technically, if we ran into gliders or something like that, that would be pretty good too. I mean... Anything really for mobility-wise would be great, especially because Team Rumble still has the grapple guns available as well. So that's why I'm saying, like, Team Rumble in general for completing challenges is probably the way to go. I was going to go for that chest, but then I was like, nah, it's all good. So I would say that, generally speaking, Team Rumble is going to allow you to complete challenges in the most efficient way possible. But... You can obviously do this in solos, in arena mode, in duos, squads, sword fight, whatever the heck mode you're playing, you should be able to go on ahead and complete this uh, as well. Now, there's an enemy right behind us that just made a landing. So that's a little disconcerting, because at this point, we really don't want to get fired upon. Now, would you look at that? Just what we need. Something for a little bit more mobility. That is excellent. So now, all we have to do is... Head right for that bunny right there. And that will give us our second item completed, which is the uh, wooden bunny challenge. Still have four minutes to work with here. Yeah, Storm is not even touched onto the ground yet, so that's great. And here's what we're going to do. We're going to... Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Okay, are you... 
You've got to be kidding me right now. Just get up this mountain towards this bunny thing. There we are. Brilliant. And now here's what we're going to do after this. Since it is Team Rumble, we're just going to take a bit of a dive down here and go like, Oh, wow, have you ever tried the water? It's great! So the reason why we're not concerned about that and why we don't have to reboot a whole new lobby and a whole new game is because we get to respawn. And as we respawn, we're just going to go on ahead... Okay, is it actually going to respawn me, though? There we go, finally. Took a sweet time there. Sure did that. Uh, we're just going to glide our way towards Lucky Landon. And luckily, there is a ton, and I mean a ton of geysers on the way to Lucky Landing. So we should be able to probably geyser our way quite far up. Maybe to the latter half of Fatal Field. But this is also why, again, I said that in Team Rumble, you can actually get all of these challenges done um, pretty quickly, you know? Because there's just so many tools available to you. Okay. So we're going to head this way. And like I said, a majority of Lucky Landing has now been covered. And what we're aiming for is this part of the map right there. So that's the specific location. That's where the uh, Stone Pig is located. And one thing that I do need to be concerned about as we head there is actually... Um, you know what I just realized? Or that I was talking about like a complete buffoon. I'm like, hi, hey, if we had gliders. It's like, you have gliders, bro. You're in Team Rumble. That's what you guys were screaming. That's another benefit of Team Rumble, I guess. So, to save ourselves a wee little bit more time as we head into the storm, all brave and stuff. Here we are, ladies and gentlemen. Time to take some storm damage, but that is fine, for we have arrived here to visit this mighty pig and complete this challenge. So as soon as we walk up to this, there we are. Visit a wooden rabbit, a stone pig, and a metal llama. Challenge completed. Congratulations, ladies and gentlemen. I hope this video was of help to you. Of course, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and of course, have an absolutely fantastic day. I do indeed hope to see you guys here for the next Fortnite video. We will continue the guide videos here very, very shortly with week number seven. And then in addition to that, some new uh, news updates will be going live as well.